We're just going to do stuff the basic. Oh my gosh, it's twins. Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And today we are going to be continuing the 100 baby challenge. And we're just going to get right into it. Okay, well last... Okay, I need to... First things first, obviously, is I need to fix this situation because they keep on getting stuck in this little corner. And it's very much annoying. I think I'm just going to expand not that just expand the house a little teeny tiny bit and then maybe they won't get stuck anymore but anyways the first thing i was actually going to say is well wait a second we still we still have an issue to fix because there used to be windows right here and now they're gone <laughs> how do windows disappear like i don't understand that I don't even think those are the right colors, but honestly, at this point, I don't even care. Yeah, okay, let's see. Those are the change the colors. Okay, I think those are the right colors. Who knows? Who cares? Okay. So there, we saw that issue, but the other issue that we were having is that I believe it was my... Okay, wait. Let me just make sure. Okay, so we only have... Yeah, we only have seven. So we have just enough to have one more baby, but my wonderful whims mod was messing up because I checked, like I said, in the other episode and it literally said she only had like 7% chance. I'm going to do another fertility test check situation and see if we can get this thing figured out. It says, yeah, it says she literally has 7% chance of getting pregnant. Okay, so I'm going to just have to adjust the stiff with the wonderful wind settings really quick okay so we're gonna i changed the settings so we're gonna try again tomorrow and hopefully it's fine so i'm just gonna basically i'm pretty sure just like send everyone to bed and see if we can get this thing working tomorrow where are you this kid is literally sleeping on the floor like okay it's time it's officially time for school so we're gonna wake everyone up so they can actually go to school. So they're all gonna go to school and they're all gonna work hard. Oh, this is new. Play games on phone. You can do that. <gasps> make enemies, make friends, listen to teacher. Flirt with classmates. I don't know if this is like a mod or if it's actually the game. She can sleep in class, sleep, 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 sleep in class and scroll on Simstagram. I don't, I feel like this has to be a mod. It might be um, slice of life. I guess do homework in class. Okay. This baby's crying. So Savannah, you need to get up and take care of this baby. And then you're going to call over who was it? Makoa. We're going to call over Makoa. Let's see. Makoa, where are you? Hopefully you're not dead because you are an elder. Oh, there you are. Here, then you're going to call over Makoa. Oh, okay. I feel like this has to be a mod. I'm really confused. I feel like this definitely has to be a mod because they're literally learning skills while they're in class you know what i think it is the mod because i think i did download the new school system um and from kawaii stacy so i think that's what's happening i think that's what's going on right now and that is so cool oh my gosh i feel like that's cheating in a way because they're totally going to be learning doing um gaining skills in school even though they are supposed to be doing that outside of school, technically, because we are doing the 100 baby challenge, but we're just gonna we're just gonna take it and go with it. Um, okay, so we invited over what's his face, um, Bjorn, not Bjorn, um, Makoa, and here he comes now. Okay, let's invite him into our house. Okay, offer rose. Okay, flirt. Do whatever else you need to do. Embrace. Oh wait. Guys, I think I invited the wrong, the wrong person because this is Mitchell. We can't do that with Mitchell. We wanted Makoa. Okay, send him home and bring Makoa over here. <laughs> I invited over the wrong person. I don't know how I didn't realize that. Okay, and then we can invite him in. We'll kiss his hand and do all the things that we were doing with Mitchell with Makoa. Okay, this kid, he really needs a bath. He's like so sad because he doesn't have a bath. But you know what? While you're waiting for that, you can go play with a toy. And actually, Carrie can actually age up too. That's like another thing. She has all of her skills. But we'll wait on that until like our older kids come home. So we can do like all of the aging up at once. Makoa has a very interesting outfit on, you know, very mismatch. Can you guys actually chat like normal people, please? 
And so after we do a quick little embrace and we'll also compliment his appearance, we are going to try and see, try the baby in the shower and hopefully that will work. Okay, and then take a pregnancy test. Cross her fingers. Yes, okay. All that heartache and for nothing. Okay, you can go home now. Okay, and then we're gonna give you a bath. Okay, you don't have to ask for a bath. We're literally about to give you a nice long bowl bath, Liam. No worries. Seems happy now. He's actually angry though, because now apparently he's tired. These kids, like, they don't stay, like, awake for very long whatsoever. It's just, like, five minutes after waking up, they're ready for bed again. But we're gonna potty train you before you go to bed, huh? Sorry for your luck. Okay, let's see where everyone's at. They're very much dehydrated, so you go get some water. How did you not get the ability to get an A? You should have gotten an A. None of you literally got an A. They were all like perfect and none of them got an A. I'm so annoyed. So annoyed, so disappointed in all of you. I miss you so much, sis. If you really do love your brother, you would come over and see me. I guess we could come over, but we'll see if she actually does that or not. I don't understand why the Sims keep on just like kneeling down and doing stuff. Like, I don't get it. Okay, Savannah, you need to come discipline this child for throwing stuff. I think this is literally the first time she'll ever discipline. Okay, okay, Frank, we get it. You wanna come over and hang out? Come on over, sure, why not? Oh my gosh, these kids have literally broken everything. They broke the toilet, the sink, and the shower, my gosh. Okay, so we need to give Carrie a bubble bath now. She's crying for some reason. She got bullied at school, what a shame. You can do your homework after you're done crying. Okay guys. My game crashed. Lovely. I shouldn't have expected that because there has been some issues since the update. But I wasn't expecting it, so my game crashed. But I've kind of gotten them back to where we ended, or where my game crashed. Kind of, sort of. Um, but we apparently got this little notification, or this little message, where... Car Wait, what is her name? Not Carrie. Not Hannah. What is their other daughter's name? I don't remember what her name is at all. Oh my gosh, that's terrible. I have no, no recollection of what her name is. But this daughter, <laughs> I don't remember her name. I have been, it says that I have been getting bullied at school and I was afraid that they would be more mean if I told the teacher, so I didn't. Is there anything you can do? Um, well, we're gonna talk to the principal about this. What is her name? Jamie! Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, Jamie. I could not remember your name. No! I hate it. So guys, unfortunately, my game crashed once again after the second try of refilming, well not refilming, but like getting back to where we were. Um, so I just had to do the whole like no sound thing and so far so good as far as catching back up. Um, so unfortunately this video won't have sound for the rest of it, unfortunately. Um, hopefully, I'm really hoping that this does not end up being a long time thing where there's gonna be videos with no sounds. But anyways, okay, so this video is gonna be really choppy in the beginning, but whatever. Um, but Max did age up. So here's his random trait. Oh my gosh, why do we get fussy sims? Okay, so we have fussy, it's so weird not being able to hear these sims doing their things. But anyways, okay, so we have Max aged up. He actually has the same hairstyle as his dad, which is, you know, typically doesn't happen with the sims, but whatever. Okay, so Savannah's potty training Liam, cause that's one of the things that I did do before I sent them all to bed. After that, He's going to eat something and then go to bed. Um, honestly, I should have aged up Carrie today, but it's just been so chaotic with the game continuously crashing and me just trying to catch back up with everything. I didn't end up having the chance to do that. So we'll age her up tomorrow or like as soon as um, they all wake up. And hopefully the older kids will also be able to age up tomorrow too because honestly they should have been able to be aged up today, honestly. But you know, this one just likes to be really annoying. Why are you awake? Okay, you want to play. She really needs to be aged up because there's no reason for her to be up. 
right now. Okay, he, instead of just running around like a crazy person, he can go and babble to this bear. Savannah, you're supposed to be asleep, but whatever. Crying. Okay, this kid is literally starving to death. So you were supposed to eat this yogurt. Why didn't you eat the yogurt? We cannot have you take it away. <laughs> oh my gosh, this video is so, so chaotic. Why aren't you eating the yogurt? Oh, because it's messy. Okay, they're just gonna eat a cake then. Okay, this cake just, oh gosh, you can't grab it. What is about this? What about this? Eat this, eat some animal crackers. What is Savannah doing up? She's literally exhausted. Why is she awake right now? Go back to sleep. And um, yes, yeah, so all the older kids go to school. You go back to sleep. Oh my gosh, and this kid, oh my gosh. Okay, Savannah, you can't go to sleep. You need to get food for this kid. <laughs> it's never ending. It's never ending. This kid is literally going to be taken away from us. Why does it say, oh my gosh. <laughs> this kid went ate the animal crackers that was meant for Liam. Okay, put it down so Liam can eat it, please. And then go back to sleep. And then Liam, please quickly eat something, please, before you get taken away, please. You're literally about to get taken away from us. <gasps> this is so stressful. Why is it saying these kids need to be at school? They don't have school. Oh my gosh. Okay. Apparently somehow they got enrolled in pre-K. They don't belong in pre-K. I never could set, sign them up for pre-K, but okay. Okay, I guess they're going to pre-K because I can't figure out how to get them to not go to pre-K. Oh my gosh. What are, what's, what's with all of these phones? All of these phones. Okay, Cameron passed away. Oh, how unfortunate. Okay, this kid literally just passed out. Okay. Okay, apparently, um, oh, what's his name? Jeffrey Jr., right? Isn't that Jeffrey Jr.? I honestly don't even remember. I think it's Jeffrey Jr. Apparently he wants to go get pampered with Hannah. So, you know what? They'll go get their nails done. Okay, this kid literally woke up depressed. Cause he had a nightmare and then also his dad died. That's just great. Okay, you can hug the bear. Maybe that will make you feel better. And then he woke up his brother cause he's literally bawling his eyes out. She's back from daycare. It honestly doesn't look like they took much care of her because she's hungry and tired. Okay, please tell me they got A's. Oh my gosh. Okay, so she got an A. Great, so she's gonna be aged up. He got an A. But this girl still has a B. How do you still have a B? Oh my gosh. Okay, you're immediately going to do your homework. Okay, let's just put this here and then put this one here and this one here for now. And then Hannah, you can blow out your candles first. <laughs> we just need to get you kids out of here, honestly, at this point. She's like sick and she's on her period and it's just not a good time for Hannah right now, honestly. Okay, yay, Hannah's aged up, yay. And she's paranoid, yay. You know what now I now realize because Little Jamie did not get an A, we're not gonna have any teenagers to help take care of this house. Like, oh my goodness. Okay, he can go blow out his candles and I'm gonna go ahead and wake her up and she'll blow out her candles as soon as. Okay, so Ian has aged up and he is a geek. Lovely, lovely. Okay, you can get up and get your stuff. You can add candles to this cake and you can blow out your candles with the help of Hannah. We're just trying to do this quick, guys, because these toddlers are chaotic and I hate it, even without the noise. Thank you, Hannah. Thank you for helping out your sister. Carrie is going to be a social butterfly child of the islands. Okay, quickly add candles to this cake, please. Okay, so we're just gonna have these two move on out because then we don't have to deal with and worry about any of these other kids, at least for a hot minute. And I just need to get out of here. And they're going to move into their own place because there's not gonna be enough room for the two of them in the other web kids house. We will do a decide their life situation for them. Decide your life and then come and decide 
Hannah's life. Okay, so Ian's life ended up. Okay, go towards shore. Um, or I don't even know what that said. Um, okay, so he had a good savings. He that's his birthday. Um, his bonus trait is weak. Lovely, you know, that's exactly what we would want. He's in the culinary field, career, whatever you want to call it. He has a small amount of friends. Um, he has good learning skills or skill learning. His, his skill learning is good. I don't know how to speak English, clearly. And he got a degree in economics. Okay, and so for Hannah, she got a degree in biology. Um, uh, do, 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 do. She has terrible savings. Lovely. Um, she has a bonus trait of clueless. Um, she's in the military career. And she has a small amount of friends as well. I think that's it. Oh, and she also has good learning skill, whatever you want to call it. However you want to say it. Yes. Okay, so let's get them a nice little house. You know what? We will go with this one. No place like gnome. I was going to give them the little gnome house, but apparently they have an insufficient funds. So we need to lower the price range down a little bit. Okay, so we have this one. You know what? This is going to be the house. Want to place this down. Furnished. Lovely. Good to go. So they now have a lovely, lovely home right next door to their siblings' house. They actually got a pool and everything and a hot tub. A pool and a hot tub. They're definitely living a life. Our household is so much smaller now and it's filled with the youngins that can't do anything for themselves. Okay, so we're just gonna go to sleep. So Savannah is cooking eggs and bacon for the kiddos. And Miss Carrie is up and she's getting her, herself ready and prepared for school. But Savannah broke this shower, so she's taking a shower down here. And then she can have some breakfast. Okay, I'm just gonna clean this up because I am so tired of them not cleaning up. I'm gonna go ahead and wake her up and she can watch a little movie. She, of course, she peed herself. Of course. Of course that would happen. And then he can go and play with the, the toy. And then hopefully um, Savannah can like help these two boys get their skills up. Well, actually it looks like Liam's, I need to figure out. I think I'm going to make sure I normally from now on take out the school system mod from the game for 100 Ruby Challenge. Okay, he didn't even eat the peas. He's going to pre-K instead. Okay, put that away, put that away, just clean this up, and all of the kids are going to be going. Okay, at least we don't have to deal with any kids right now, that's a plus. Okay, so first things first, we're just gonna make sure everything is nice and clean. Okay, clean this up, throw that away, the toilet's fine, the shower's fine, this shower needs to be repaired, this sink needs to be clean. And then we will work on our, oh, well, looks like someone had a little fun in the backyard. Um, and then we will work on our garden. Yeah, I definitely need to make sure I definitely take this mod out because look at their skills already. He's already level four, communication, imagination, level three, thinking literally all he means is his movement and potty, which definitely is not accurate. And then like this kid literally just got aged up. First time going to pre-K. He already has communication three, imagination two, <laughs> movement two, and he's a good bit through his thinking and um, he has a bit of potty. So I don't think pre-K is very fair for me to be doing the 100 baby challenge with. Okay, and then I'm gonna have her go, well, I was gonna have her like do the little play thing with him, but she can't do that because she's pregnant. So we're just gonna give him a nice bubble bath because both of these boys are pretty stinky. They probably need their diapers changed too, let's be honest. Okay, the girls are back. And she still doesn't have an A. Oh my gosh, I'm going to scream. I'm going to scream. How does Jamie still not have an A? How? How do you not have an A? Okay, I'm gonna have Savannah chit chat with this kid because his social is super, super low. Okay, so I'm gonna have Savannah, now that she's done chatting, to Liam, I'm gonna have her start potty training Max. 
<laughs> I don't know any of these kids' names, let's be honest. Okay, and then these girls need to go do their homework. And then they need to- why are- <sighs> Toilet run from upset stomach. Well, then go to the toilet. Go poop or something. And then you will do your homework. Okay, he can go to sleep now. Okay, she can go to sleep because she finished her homework. Savannah can go to sleep as soon as she's finished bathing that kid. And then we also need to put these away before they go bad. And I might make her suffer a little bit. She's just, and make her do some of it. Well, let her do the project on the, in the inside. I may make Savannah really upset and I'm gonna make her potty train Liam before she can go to bed because he can't potty on his own and he has to go to the bathroom. Savannah's gonna pass out like any second now. Okay, and then you can go to the, go to bed. Okay, see now he's level two and now you don't ever have to worry about that ever again. And then he'll go to bed. Look at that, Alex is helping his little sister do her project. How cute. How cute is that? She is very much exhausted. But maybe if you work together, you can hurry up and get it done. She's not going to get it done before she has to go to school. But, you know, what's she thinking? What are you doing up, kid? What are you doing up? Go play. Oh, she's passed out. Okay. You can go to sleep then, I suppose. Well, Alex finished the project for Jamie. So, so much for that helping her with her school. He now has level three communication and imagination. So he can go ahead and have breakfast. I feel like I'm cheating so bad, but like not intentionally. I did not know that the school system mod would make them automatically go to pre-K. Did not know that was a thing. So whoopsie daisy. We'll fix it next time. Honestly, they might end up aging up by the end of this episode, but I'm gonna go ahead and send him back off to bed because he's tired yet again. Cause like literally toddlers can only do like two things before they get tired. Oh, and they're not going to school today. Lovely, I forgot about that. It's harvest fest, so they will not be going to school. So they, today's just gonna be a chill day. And hopefully Jamie definitely will get an A next time she goes to school. And then you can try and appease one of these gnomes. Why don't you give this one a pie? See if you end up getting electrocuted or not. You probably will. Did her dad die too? Yep, her dad died too. I don't even know who her dad is, but apparently he's dead. Okay, and you can give this one a pie. And you can give this one a future cube. Okay, lovely. We actually had success with all of those gnomes. I'm shocked. Just won the lottery, so I was sharing the money with friends. Here you go. Thank you. Thank you very much. But it was only $110. But I mean, hey, we will accept any amount of money. Thank you very much. And those three are all watching this lovely movie together, but we can't hear it because we can't have the sound on or the game will crash. She's literally outside, like by herself eating cereal. Of all things, cereal. Like she's like, she needs to talk to her sister, I feel like. Finish your cereal and then you can have a nice long chats with your sister. Okay. Why don't you cheer up your sister, uh, make some funny faces at her, give her a nice big hug, let's do something funny, um, make fun of adults, you know, that's always funny, right? And these two girly girls, well, that got ruined. For some reason, she just decides that she's going to not swing with her sister. Rude! Literally, as soon as I came over here, they decided to stop swinging. Together. No, you guys need to swing together. Look at that. These two sisters swinging together. Lovely, lovely. Okay, I'm so confused. Jamie did not go to school, but it says, Jamie has been working hard and she's now a grade eight student. Great job. What is wrong with my game? <laughs> I hate this. But you know what? We will take it and we will age her right on up today. It is not only going to be a Harvest Fest ce celebration, it's also going to be a birthday celebration. Why? Oh, Smith is leaving to go visit her other children apparently, so we will send these two off to daycare. Honestly, that works for me because that means I don't have to take care of toddlers. Perfect. Okay, and then you two, actually, what you guys can do now that you're not feeling um, so depressed, you guys can work on this project together to ensure... Okay. They weren't at the daycare nearly as long as I would have liked them to be. 
That's very much unfortunate, but okay. Savannah, you need to put this away. And then you need to make a good old grand harvest fest meal. How about we do a fish dinner, right? And then these boys, oh my gosh, Savannah went into labor. And this kid, literally all he needs to do is like potty like a couple of times and he will be good to go. We are having a harvest fest baby, apparently. You need to just go wandering around to build up your, um, um, what is that called? Your... What in the world is that called? Your... You need to build up your movement skill. My goodness. We shall join Savannah, um, with Makoa, who's just going to abandon us. Okay, so Savannah had to abandon the Harvest Fest meal to go and have this child. Makoa's freaking out. And then in five, four, three, two, one, he's leaving. <laughs> Savannah just knows what to do on her own. She's like, I don't need you guys to help me whatsoever. I've been doing this a bunch of times. I think it's like, what, the 13th child? And it's a little girl and her name is going to be Nicole for N. How about that? We're just gonna do something basic. Oh my gosh, it's twins. Okay. Well, she's gonna be O, so um, her name will be Olivia! Nicole and o oh, I just typed all of there. Okay, Nicole and Olivia, it will be. Please that be that. Let that be it. Okay. Makoa, thanks a lot for giving us twins to take care of. So that means every single aspect of their lives is going to be together. So that means we're definitely going to have to deal with two toddlers to make my life so wonderful. Okay, now back to Harvest Fest. And we only have one crib in our thing, so lovely. So they're gonna have like the weird little like caveman crib that I have <laughs> with my other game. Okay. You know what, we're just gonna continue with the fish dinner. You know, that's just what we're gonna do. Where's the other child? Oh, of the cross in here. You know what? Actually, these, well, no, you know what? I'm gonna keep them down here because when they get aged up into toddlers, we don't wanna have to deal with figuring out where to put them. You know what? That one's just gonna go right there. And they're hungry. Lovely. You know what? How about, Jamie, why don't you invite some of your siblings over? You can invite Hannah, Ian, Jeffrey, Frank. You can invite them all over. Do you know any other siblings, hon? Um, nope, you don't. Okay. Okay, so all of the children should be over. And maybe they can just take initiative and take care of these babies that are probably crying. But luckily, I can't hear it because I can't have sound in my game. That's one plus to this. Don't you dare destroy that! Don't you dare! <gasps> you little terrible toddler! Oh my gosh! You are the worst. Oh my gosh. For what reason? For meeting new siblings? That's really condoned. Trashing your other siblings' stuff. So now those girls are gonna cry because you destroy their thing. See, she's sad, but she's not destroying anything. She's just looking in the mirror like a little sad girl, okay? You could be sad in other ways besides destroying things. Emotional control, please. Call for grand meal, even though everyone like went and got stuff from the fridge already. Whatever. And they ate my cake. They ate my little cake. Lovely. And obviously no one took care of these children. So we'll fish it a super efficient baby care of this kid. You girls can just go to sleep. Go to sleep. Okay, this kid is saying that he's eating, but he's obviously not because his hunger thing is not going up at all. So we're gonna try that again. This kid is still not eating. Oh my gosh, he's gonna starve himself because he refuses to eat anything. Please eat. And then Savannah will go. How did Savannah have an awful harvest fest? How? The girls had successful Harvest Fest, so I don't understand how hers was awful. You know, it was probably awful because she literally had to push out a baby. You know, I could have two babies at that, actually. She had to push out two babies, so I could understand, actually, how it was awful. And he's still not eating. Okay, yeah, it was just the fish dinner. Apparently, he just wasn't feeling it. He was not feeling the fish dinner, apparently. And now they're all in bed, and then she immediately wakes up. But you know what? That doesn't matter. We're just gonna end this video right here, right now. <laughs> 
because it's it's getting a little chaotic. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did like this video, you can give this video a thumbs up. You can also comment down below and you can also subscribe to my channel. Thank you again for watching guys. Bye.